in our previous lecture you have learned about slope intercept form today we learn about point slope form what is it see look at this line this red line this passes through the point minus 2 comma 3 this point and has an angle of inclination of 60 degree right so this line could be defined by a point and the angle of inclination and because of you have the angle of inclination you could easily find out the slope slope is what tan 60 that is tan theta theta represents angle of inclination so tan theta which is tan 60 gives you root 3 so this line is actually defined by a coi a point that which has the y, x and y coordinates and the slope right so this is known as point slope form now we will find out the equation of a straight line but that is this line only you can say using coordinates of a point on the line and the slope or angle of inclination of the line so how to take out the equation of such lines which have the coordinates of a point on the line and the slope or the angle of inclination now you know that equation of the line in slope intercept form is what y is equal to mx plus c right so let us name this as equation 1 now let the line pass through say any line passes through a point and here we have to learn that so here let the line pass through x1 y1 so this is already equation of a line this line passes through this point x1 y1 then what will happen we have to replace x and y here with x1 y1 let's do it y1 replaces y is equal to m x1 x1 replaces x plus c right so let us say that this is equation 2 okay now to eliminate c we subtract this equation from this why do we need to eliminate c can you tell me in the first equation we were given the slope and the intercept so we have the information of c but now we have to find out the equation of a straight line using coordinates of a point on the line and the slope we are not informed about the intercept so we have to eliminate this intercept so we have to eliminate the intercept so that we can get points on the line or one single point on this line and the slope so let us eliminate c how will we do that we will subtract these two equations subtract these two equations here c minus c this gets cancelled m mx minus mx1 so m is common and here y minus y1 so we get y minus y1 is equal to m bracket x minus x1 so you can see one thing here we have y1 x1 which will be the coordinate of a point on that line and m will be the slope so if we have this this and this we are left with what an equation in terms of x and y so again here we learn how to form the equation of a straight line when coordinates are given and slope is given so the equation of a straight line in point slope form point slope point having the x and y coordinate and slope is that m is y minus y1 is equal to m x minus x1 this is also known as one point form let us apply this in sums a straight line passes through a point 1 comma 5 and its slope is 1 what is the equation of the straight line let me ask you a question if a line has a slope of 1 what is its angle of inclination can you tell me well tan theta is what we call as slope so tan theta is equal to 1 so what will be the value of theta tan 45 is equal to 1 so tan theta is equal to tan 45 so theta here is 
45 degree. So the angle of inclination of this line is what? 45. Well, we do not require that information here. Now we come back to what is the equation of this straight line. Here, y1 is 5, x1 is 1. We have this point, x1, y1, and m is already given to us as 1. Now, what is the equation of this straight line? You know that you are having a point and the slope. So we will use the point slope form. The equation of a point slope form is y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. So what you need to do? Just substitute these values and get an equation in terms of x and y. Solve this. So y minus y1, 5, is equal to m, that is 1, x minus x1. Now you may have a question that what if I write these values in place of x and y and leave y1 and x1? Well, you can do the same. You will get the same answer. J it's just that we prefer writing these values or the values you have in question in place of x1, y1 so that you can get the equation in terms of x and y. Otherwise, you will get the equation in terms of x1, y1. Okay? So solve this. x minus 1 plus 5, that will give you what? x plus 4, right? So, y is equal to x plus 4 is the equation of this straight line. So, now you know that the equation of a straight line in point slope form is y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1 where x1, y1 are the coordinates of that point on the line and m is the slope. This is also known as one-point form. 